So Hey everybody, Tony Horton here and back in 2012 I did a little home gym tour and that was a long time ago and that was a different house but I've moved and now I got a pretty cool new gym and I've got some outside stuff too I think you're going to enjoy. So let's all check it out right here, right now. This is my gym. Now, uh, back in 2012, like I said earlier, I had a gym in um, Sentinel, another part of town, and I moved up into the mountains. And this particular room used to be a garage and a bedroom. So I knocked down some walls and I made a home gym. Now, as you can see over here, we got a couple of dumbbells and we got a bunch of mats, you know, because we have vents here at the house. Over here, we got your standard stuff, got your stationary bike. We've got the Versa Climber, obviously. This thing is torture, but it's lovely and it burns the calories. Like, yikes. Then we got my total over here. Check that out. Let's see. Voila. We got the heavy bag over here. Boom. Smacking. Crack it. It's a water bag. We got the treadmill. Very exciting. Our mats. And this is where I sleep at night. And up to this, right like this. And we got a TV. We do the workouts there. Got your med balls right there. And then as you turn around, you can kind of see we have our plyo boxes and the skier's edge machine and a rower. And a lot of open space in the middle, which is what we use often. And then up there, that's the beam that holds up most of the house. We got a little pegboard up there. That's kind of fun. Oh, hello. I am Batman. I want to drink your blood. Anyway, this is my teeter hang-up, and we don't have it in the gym, but it's kind of technically part of the gym. It's pretty cool. It's really good for my spine. Oh, and every time I lay in this thing for more than 10 minutes, I'm three quarters of an inch taller every time. And here's what's cool about it. Check it out. So I get upside down, right? And then I kind of turn that way. That's good for the spine. I go this way. Oh, that's lovely. And then I arch, and then I like that and, and it makes my stomach look really flat. See how good that looks? Here is a pretty cool thing inside the gym. Uh, this is Kobe Bryant's last game and these are tickets to that game and uh, pretty cool. Sean and I went. Tim Harris, the president of the Lakers, got us these seats. Also passes to the chairman's room which is pretty nice too. You get a lot of free food and, and drink in there as well and Kobe scored 60 points last game. Really an amazing moment. And so, of course, I had to frame it up and put it in the gym. Welcome to the sauna. Of course, if you're going to exercise, you got to heal as well. This is an infrared sauna, which is really, really cool. Helps with inflammation and also a little cardiovascular health as well. Very cool. By Sunlighten and Pulp Sunlight. Very awesome. By the way, this used to be a wine room. And the alcohol. So I put this baby in there. It's awesome. I love it. It's about recovery. And they're beautiful too. And of course, if you come to the Horton house and you work hard, you get snacks. These are healthy snacks. I don't mess around. You know, nuts and bars and things that are not filled with processed garbage. Right? So that's for anybody who shows up. And we've got towel, towel organization. Very, very important. Right? Yoga towels and Sweaty towels. And oh, look at the water cooler. It's got reverse osmosis and three filters. It's like a babbling brook before dinosaurs in the fjords of Norway. That's how fresh that is. But enough of the inside. It is time to go outside. Come with me. We're on to a new adventure here at the Horton House of health and fitness. This is another little section where we work out. Now, there you'll see the pegboard. That actually came from the old house before I came here to the new pad. And one of the cool moves is you do the pegboard, you go up and then you go up that beam. And then at the top there you ring the bell and then you come down the rope. And then you go back up the rope and you ring the bell again and then you go down the beam. And then the pegs, of course, will be up in that left hand corner. And then you make your way to that corner and then you do maximum pull ups on those things. It requires a certain amount of fitness and strength. It's a good one. There's all kinds of patterns you can do here on the pegboard as well. We have one called Four Corners, one's called Around the World, another one is called 
hourglass and a brand new one is called zigzag zigzagging up and down and that'll be fun <laughs> Well, every facility should have beauty, right? Because you want to take in some beauty in between exercising and killing yourself. So we have succulents here and flowers and get these old pallets and I put little bottoms in, a little bit of dirt and voila. This one is especially nice. It's got the pink flowers and everything, the red. It's... So here is the ninja course. I was very fortunate. The only reason why I have this is because it was given to me, which was kind of a fluke, because the person who bought it discovered it was really, really hard, and one of his employees got hurt on it, and so he gave it to me. And we get hurt on it too, but we like it. We do one of the routines, it's called Ninja One. We start here, world-renowned salmon ladder. All right, so. and so on. Axis, we're gonna throw axis. Now, that looks like this. One. Two. Three. Almost four. So every good fitness facility needs a beautiful utility closet. So look inside of there. You got stands, frisbees, med balls, ropes, boxing gloves, sandbags, everything. It's athletic. Oh, places and things. And here we keep the chalk so we can grab onto things and not fall down. Very important closet here at the Horton Fitness Facility. Follow me down here. Let me show you more things. So in between sets, this is where I spend some time. That way I can point to others and say, Scott, you can go deeper on those push-ups. Wesley, jump higher over there, my friend. Chelsea, that handstand, mm, too perfect. You're going to have to work on making that sloppy. But wait, there's more. That's right. We got more than just throwing axes and working out inside and ninja courses and ropes and pegboards. There's one more area. Follow me. It's over here. So we have the high bar. Like here's a fun move. The classic pullover. I'm up here. And then those are fun. And then over here, check it out. Everybody has pull-up bars. Those are fine. We've got parallel bars. So I'm up. I do my dips. I do my L's. Walk. Fun. Yay. Now the other rope is 17 feet high. This one is 20. One of the exercises is climb the rope. No feet, maximum pull-ups at the top, come on down, no feet. It's a heck of a feat, really, when you think about it. But -um -um -um, I'm here all week. So there you go, everybody. That's the Horton House of Fitness, both indoor and outdoor. So we cover upper body, lower body, plyometrics. Of course, there's always yoga. We can do that anywhere here at the Horton House. But the key that I've learned over the course of all these many years is variety, variety, variety. From the old days back when we did P90X to right here and now with the power of four. Lots of variety, you avoid the boredom, injuries, and plateaus from doing the same things over and over again, expecting you're going to get some kind of change or different results, right? So there you go. Hope you enjoyed the tour. Tony Horton saying over and out. Hey Power Nation, Tony Horton here, and you're about to take your very first step towards long-lasting health and fitness. Now, I've created a brand new program, and it's called The Power of Four. The four fundamental principles of this program are nutrition, exercise, supplementation, 
and mindfulness. Now, after 30 plus years in the health and fitness industry, it's felt like it's time to create a brand new program based on everything that I have learned over the course of my entire career. Now, I know you'll love them. And if you want to check out my entire program and the entire Power of Four library, just sign up for the base or premium membership at PowerNationFitness.org. And as we say in Power Nation, it is your time to earn it, live it, and fall in love with the Power of Four.